Hello, welcome to An Old Man Plays Seven Days to Die, Episode 10. Hi, I'm Bob. Last time we found this small town and uh, decided this was going to be our base. What I'm thinking of doing, um, I'm going to bridge across to this other building, block that up, make that my entrance, probably have my forges on top, and store my stuff in here. Um, so being the night's coming along, I shall probably try and get a bridge built across um, but I'm just not sure how far I can go without these collapsing. Uh oh. Game has frozen for some reason. I have no idea why. Down to nine frames. Okay, back up again now. I have no idea why that happened. Let's see if we can get this onto there. Yes, I don't want to fall and die, I know. Quite rich. Uh, I just think one more is risking it too much. All right, this is so risky. Same height. Right, I really don't know. That's got to be close to the limit. Right, have I still got um, Right, okay. I haven't got a repair tool or anything. Got a couple of windows on and block up downstairs. And what is actually my base. And, um... go and check. I have been here. What I'll have to do is I'll just quickly get a bit of um Hello there you Oh you're gonna start running any minute. Don't want to leave. Oh, can I do anything else? That's what I needed. We best get back in here pretty quick. And 
just uh Get off over here for now. Right. Um, I think I just made a total mess of myself there. Um, right, we'll put coal away. Really blocks. Put clay away. Guns. Yeah, I don't really know if I want to make a short shotgun though, that's really that good. Up right there. Food. Ammo. Paper should be in there. Yeah, I'll start putting metals in this one. Right, okay, so now I think I'll just make myself. A stone axe. So I can repair and upgrade this stuff. take him out for now. They can go and do what they like. Um, we'll make a door. And we'll just put him in there. Yeah, I've sort of forgotten where I'd gotten to and what I was doing. down and put a few of the blocks that we've got. Oh, you're visiting, are you? I'll let you come in then. Come in there. Come on. I don't want you blocking my window. Because I want to be able to... Um... Coming in. <sighs> oh, 
Oh, come on. Okay, I need to block that window. Okay, we'll look around, see if you're damaging anything too much. Just while uh, waiting. Ah, good. We should have become thought now. Right, that's better. That's me a little bit happier. Right. I think we'll uh, repair a few of our tools here. Definitely don't want to lose them. Yeah, I think I'm going to go upstairs. Have a look, see if I can... And what I'll do, I'll modify it so the ground floor is just there. Not accessible, even if they knock all the water out. Ooh, nearly fell off. Broke a few limbs. Really? Yeah, I'm not having a lot of luck here, yeah, right. I will tomorrow with a bit of a better day um, consolidate consolidate 
these uh, buildings a bit better. that they can't get in if they um, even if they want to oh I've run out of food I really should eat something really not paying attention actually what it is I've uh, got to admit I've been distracted this morning and uh, I've been watching um, some playthroughs of Fallout 4, beginning of Fallout 4. I've been waiting for that game for a long time. Absolutely looks pretty good. Um, very tempted to buy it this morning. Um, came out yesterday. Um, and I've decided not to at the moment. Um, I might actually watch how it plays. A few things I didn't like the look of that much. So I want to see... Once it's a bit more free roaming, it's, it's a bit linear at the moment. Go and do this, go and do that. Which wasn't particularly looking forward to. Uh, it's not sort of like... I like it just to be totally free what you do. Um... So, I didn't really have my head in the right place for playing today. Um, so, that's why um, I've sort of forgotten where, where, where I was. I didn't realise it was that close to night time. Um, bow. And for some reason my aim's out as well at the moment. No idea why. Um, I don't want to scrap them. Come on. Uh, what else have we got? Right, I think I best make somewhere to cook some food. Um, so we'll just make a campfire. I might um, fill my water bottles up, some water, um, and just get sort of settled in here, sorted in here. I can't even remember where I put everything. I'm normally fairly good with where I put stuff. Water jar. I'll go find my toilet. Um, I'm hoping my man is intelligent enough to fill it up from the system rather than the bowl. Because you don't really want it from the bowl, do you? Let's face it. There we go. 
I can have to cook away. Keep burning item. What items are burning? There. I like a nice Spartan house. I will probably get rid of a lot of this. Um, in fact, I will probably... Well... What I'll probably do now is I'll probably go down and collect the scrap iron from down the lower level. Um, because as soon as I've got enough animals, I'll um, be making my forge. Um, and I can really start building or improving my building. Um, which is obviously a priority. Um, day three, we've still got a little bit of time. Should be in nice shape for when my first wandering horde comes along. Looks like strange or annoying rather that you can't um you think? Uh, yeah, we really should be able to. Especially being it's not so around you say feel like the uh, water dials or the loo, it's not like just that there's the reserve left in there, it seems to be filling up again, right? because of the internet supply, or I'm ending supply of water. So, therefore, you better get some sinks. You hear a lot that they want it to be more realism. So if you don't have to have unending water, which isn't really much of a reason. Can't go to one square a one square hole. Not really a reason. If I was surviving in this situation and I had a bunch of zombies chasing me, I'd get through a half minute of a hole. And, uh, a little top right window I'd get through it if I had to. <laughs> Um, there are some inconsistencies, but I still love the game. I know a game can't be, if it was so real, you wouldn't be able to play it. Um, now for instance now, well, I might be able to carry one of these sh shelves upstairs. Yeah, so... I definitely would rather carry 500 logs of, uh, of a tree. <laughs> um, but, if you really them, you better build them. You know, what you can collect one log, maybe two, and it would be unplayable. Um, major hit on the frames again, and I don't know why. It just dipped right down to 20, back up to 60 again. I don't know what is causing my problem. Um, it shouldn't be having anything. So, I have no idea. Oh, I should be drinking a bit of beer, shouldn't I really? Oh, the other thing was... I mean, it's it so much scrap in these, didn't it? In the earlier versions. One of my favourites was, um... Uh, filing cabinets. You hit them once. You can carry the filing cabinet around, you can carry 64 of them. And each one was 8 scrap. Then you actually put in your inventory and scrap that. Whenever I went anywhere, I would uh, you know, always pick up the final cabinets. Uh, 
went down for a run. Uh, I don't know. There are two now, so they're not worth it. They take got several hits to hit with a purple axe or purple pickaxe. So they're really not worth the scrap. What I'll eventually do is when I've got my um, um, forge sorted, I'll replace most of these walls with iron bars. Bikes outside. So I'll have everything around here. No strap. I will just empty out this room. I'll put some supports in on that wall out. Um, have ladders going up. That's my Third method of modification. Yeah, it just sets much more awkward for the little bugger to get me. Just using up time here to uh, pass the night by. Uh, I won't take my walls out until I've got my iron bar in place. Um, I will initially leave um, the same thing right down here. I think I've taken my lead. Oh, there's no safe in this one. Ah, oh, where are we? There we are. Let's go and put some of this stuff upstairs. Yes, I did close my door. Oh, right. There's my timer. So I will end this here. Uh, good morning.